So a few months ago, uh, a good friend of mine gave my kids these little toys that go along with a video game. I guess they unlock things in the games when you buy the toys. And clearly they, they have little chips in the bottom and they would sit on these sensors to, to activate stuff in the game. And I thought, how cool would it be to be able to use these in with my computer and program to do anything? And I was hoping that I'd just be able to plug in my card reader and scan them. Uh, I looked it up real quick and it seemed like they were working on the same frequency, but I could not find my card reader. Well, I finally found it over in the corner of my room. These are ten, fifteen dollars. Uh, and, and different chips work, work on different frequencies, but there's really only two or three frequencies that things work on. So when these get scanned, all they do is basically, with this device, type out a number. It's always the same number. So now I can program my computer to do anything uh, when one of these is scanned. I can have it open up a program. I can op have it play a video. I can have it send an email. Like, let's say I want to send an email to my buddy, and my buddy's... You know, let's say I, I'm going to say he's Thor. I can scan that. It can open up my email application to email him. Right now, I just, as a quick test, all I did was I set up uh, to change the wallpaper on my, my monitor here. So right now it's set to Hawkeye. But if I take Hulk and I scan him, boom, it changes to Hulk wallpaper. Or we can scan Thor and it changes it to Thor wallpaper. Go back to, to Hawkeye here. Hawkeye wallpaper. And Captain America, we'll see on him. And it is Captain America. And again, it's literally just typing in like a serial number. You, you can you can see what it's typing out here. This is the code for each one of them. And and what I've done so far is just this one line of code. A little long, but all it's saying is, you know, constantly read what's being typed, then change the background. I have two monitors, so I have it in here twice. It's changing one monitor to this image. And then it's changing the other one to the one that's scanned. And then it loops. That's it. It's, it's really one command to change the wallpaper, one command to, to read what's being typed by the statue, and then it's just looping. And I have it printing out here what it's typing. But I can have that be running in the background, and uh, yeah, we can... And again, I'm just changing images, but it can do anything. I have play a movie. Like, uh, oh, anytime I want to watch the Incredible Hulk movie, boop. Or maybe I want to do a, a web search on the Incredible Hulk, boop. But I can program it to do anything, which is... Pretty freaking cool. And these are just uh, four of them. Uh, they, they gave us a bunch of them. And uh, I look forward to playing around with these. And I'm thinking about maybe incorporating, maybe making my own game and incorporating them into it. But it's pretty cool. Uh, so I'm thankful to my friends who gave us these. And I'm thankful that, that I finally found my card reader. Because I use this thing for a lot of stuff. And uh, although it's cheap, I didn't want to buy another one since I already had one. So, yeah, that's it. Hulk smash.